In an effort to attain the vision of being Kenya's most reliable and trusted broadcaster, KBC has entered into an agreement with one of the leading consultant and audit firm Deloitte to carry out an assessment of the corporation and its services. The agreement will see the consultancy firm embark on a three-month audit on the corporation to establish the strengths and weaknesses as well as opportunities that can be tapped to boost quality services. Three to four months will be able to, to have a report which will be discussed by the board of the corporation and then the implement, implementation will start. In other words, what we are saying is that come January we should be well patched on our plan to modernize this institution. Speaking while signing the agreement, KBC Managing Director Waidaka Waihenya assured viewers and supporters of the leading broadcaster of improved quality services and presentation once the corporation implements the recommendations to be given by the consultancy firm. At the end of the exercises, we'll be able to know our strengths, our weaknesses, and where we need to be in future. U.S. has become an extremely important and uh, also competitive industry, and I think it gives us a great opportunity one, to bring uh, the world-class nature of a firm like Deloitte to assist a good business uh, and a good corporation like KBC. The process of modernization of the national broadcaster will feature the two TV stations, KBC Channel 1 and Heritage TV, which is on digital platform, both owned by the corporation. Over 10 FM radio station owned by KBC will also be scrutinized on how to enhance high quality broadcasts of educative, objective and entertaining content. Kevin Washira, Channel 1 News.